And we were delighted that the St. James congregation uh, invited First Presbyterian uh, into their 150th celebration anniversary. And I'm also delighted to share leadership in this service with my friend and colleague, Reverend Diane Moffitt from St. James. How good and pleasant it is when brothers and sisters dwell together in unity. I wish you could see from where I sit. This is a joyous day. I look to you. Because if churches, if Christians who model the love of Jesus and the reconciliation of the cross, if we can't show, if we can't show the way, then who can? And reconciliation is tough and forgiveness can be challenging. And at times you may want to even give up. We are not reconciled, nor can we engage this ministry of reconciliation merely by our strength and power. Reconciliation is possible when we are in Christ, covered, coated, captured, and changed by the Holy Spirit who was present in him and who is present with us now. Teach us to love, Teach us to love. and forgive one another. As you, have loved, as you have loved and forgiven us. And forgiven us. In, the name of Jesus we pray. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Amen. May the good Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make God's face to shine upon you. May the Lord lift up God's countenance and be gracious unto you, giving you peace, poise, and power for the living of these days and always. Amen. Amen. Amen.